it's Fuka Shigi here again and today we are delving deep into a topic that hits close to home. For many of us navigating the challenging job market as a new immigrant here in Canada or you are planning to move for work or as an international student, you need to hear everything I have packed for you in today's video. So please don't forget to subscribe, especially if you're new here. And please feel free to share your thoughts, your opinions in the comment section below. I have partnered with Dacier and um, they are hosting the most incredible Black Friday sale for the year. So if you are anything like me who loves to get early, you know, with your holiday shopping, especially when you have a long list of family members to get some gifts for, then you will want to grab on this opportunity fine with the cs black friday sale i know i can find the perfect gift for each of my family members from luxurious perfume to elegant candles and mood enhancing diffusers oh yes they have new product range available on their website best part is that whenever i shop Dacier, i feel as if i'm not breaking the bank but at the same time getting top notch gifts for people that i truly love that's yes product and known for its product quality and also its affordability so i'm going to be sharing some of my personal favorites from dossier and i will be giving you a sneak peek into my collection for the month the first on my list is the woody chestnut perfume this smells really really great guys oh my god so let's look at the top notes uh for this particular perfume the top notes pear orange blossom cloves middle note you have chestnut kayak wood cade and base note you have vanilla peru balm and cedar wood this smells very very amazing smells really sophisticated and of course this is my second collection gourmand orange blossom gourmand orange blossom this smells really really nice it has this fruity scent and as you can see the top note is orange blossom black currant hazelnut middle note you have oris jasmine sambac and patchouli and base notes you have praline vanilla and tonka bean this is so amazing so guys double up on this one go get it while the offer lasts and don't forget to use the discount code so remember to use the code FUKESUYI5 to unlock extra discount and I wish you a fantastic time shopping so when it comes to decoding the job market first thing first understanding the job market in your new place of residence a new place where you're calling home is very very important you might have heard about canada's mixed job situation the thing is that opportunities are there but it has become very competitive over the years in fact there's been a lot of outcry on social media maybe tiktok blogs instagram name it the job market has drastically changed from what it used to be say about two three four years ago i know of a student who landed here in canada approximately one and a half year ago but couldn't even get a job interview talk less of a job offer this international student of course had tried everything she was already depressed and was close to going back home and this is also a situation for many families who are just landed here in canada looking for jobs trying to pay their bills trying to cater for their household has become so difficult nowadays so a lot of people are actually now faced with the reality of things especially on ground this is not about watching a youtube channel hearing what people's experiences are this is you experiencing it for yourself the truth is stories differ from family to family so what does this mean to you it means first of all getting smart about your job hunt even if it means that uh, you may need to upskill join some boot camps or even go as far as hiring a mentor pivoting into another career path and also knowing where the opportunities are don't follow the joneses because this particular 
province is you know filled with people and they pay low taxes or maybe they have lots of job opportunities and you feel that that province is best for you to settle in do your homework know what is priority for you and also tailoring your skills accordingly to what is required to what is needed and the truth be told eh, all of these that i had just mentioned is definitely not cheap okay it either costs money or time and of course you need to keep pushing you need to be consistent now let's move over to the student challenge okay so for those of you intending international students or you're an international student who just landed here in canada you have a lot of balls to juggle at the same time you're trying to balance your studies with job search and trust me it's not just about your grade at the same time you are navigating work permit rules also trying not to exceed the allowable work hours on your permit okay you're trying to make ends meet you're also at the same time trying to look for you know PR pathways that you can opt for especially after your studies not forgetting the culture shock the work culture people and also if you're required to learn a new language it's like starting a race <laughs> with several steps behind yes so how do you actually navigate yourself especially if you find yourself in this shoe well my advice would be tap into the resources available especially at your school that can be a good starting point for you from career services to um, alumni networking to job fairs those are your lifelines here in Canada. And for those internship roles, for part-time jobs, grab them like your life depends on it because they are not just going to give you income, but it's more or less your gateway to um, getting Canadian experience and also building valuable connections that will help you through your journey here in Canada. Not also forgetting some agencies like Adeco, Kelly Services and the rest. There are lots of recruitment agencies here in Canada. This will also help you put a foot in the door so i want to hear from you especially if you've been an international student here in canada or if you are a new immigrant who just recently landed what has been your biggest challenge here in canada let's fill up the comment section let me know your thoughts on this all right so let's talk about something super important okay doing your homework before moving before relocating abroad researching 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 can never ever be enough researching about the job market about local culture new visa rules cost of living everything in between is important and in case you're asking why is this important well because the more you know the better the better it will be for you to navigate and also the fewer the surprises you're going to encounter all right and as they popularly say knowledge is not just power it is more like a shield it is your guide and it's going to set you up for success in a way that it will help you manage all expectations and also it's about making informed decision as you join through your way here as an immigrant okay having a strategy as well will help you move from not just surviving but thriving in this new country so guys i decided to keep it short and uh if you like videos like this just let me know in the comment section share your thoughts and um, i'm really excited that i'm able to share this on here we need to do better by researching and we also need to do better by being very realistic when it comes to leaving your home leaving everything that you know settling i tell you is not easy moving abroad is more than just changing location it's a leap into a new chapter of growth opportunities possibilities and it can go the other way around so if you found this video helpful please share this video and don't forget to give this video a like don't forget to subscribe for more and until i come your way again guys stay strong stay inspired and i will see you in my next video till then take care and god bless